Next, we will be watching the presentations of Team 9 to Team 16. Now let's welcome Team 9, Hua San University from Vietnam. presentation about Saigon. Welcome on board with Hua Sen Voyage. My name is Fu, here is Ting and Jane. Today we will guide you to the busiest city of Vietnam, Saigon, which is known as Ho Chi Minh City. Both names are actually point out the same place. However, Saigon is not just a name, it's also a personality. Traveling to Saigon is around 3 hours and 25 minutes, which is the average amount of time when travel from other Asian destinations like Bangkok, Taipei, Hong Kong, or Singapore. Now, please fasten your seatbelt. Let us show you some interesting insights on the way. Saigon has 8 million inhabitants, but the actual number could be up to 14 million. The average temperature is 30 degrees and there are only two seasons. It's going to be hot and maybe rainy, so please make sure that you always apply the sun cream. Upon a driver, try not to get lost in the marvel of architecture where modern beats own. Historical and new buildings, houses are really side by side. Here is the Seventeen Saigon Hotel, the Asians leading conference hotel, and the Meridian Hotel, another Asian hotel, and the best traveler choice all with stylish rooms and suits, international standard meeting space for successful and comfortable business events at the end of the day. And here's a few tips on how to survive in Saigon. Traveling around Saigon with the help of technology has never been easier using Taxi's app. The Sharing Economy Taxi Services app will ensure your safety and also very economical. Now, we are entering gym exhibition and convention center, a 10,000 square meter multi-function world-class facility with space transforming ability in less than one hour. Whoa, time flies. It's time for good dinner. Would you love some local cuisine like pho or banh mi or some cruise steak? Cheers, Cheers for the first day. Mo hai ba yo. Pink, would you now introduce us to some famous attractions? Yes, yeah, sure. Ladies and gentlemen, in Chinatown, you will see a mixture of colonial and post-colonial architecture, including temples, church, and local housing among Chinese architecture. Next, in the Museum of Traditional Medicine, where you will experience a traditional pharmacy with authentic collection of Vietnamese tonics and remedies based on the herbal culture of the local. And last but not least, just 10 minutes away, we'll soon arrive at Notre Dame Cathedral. A 140 years old French Gothic style church stand at the local symbol of Saigon. Hey Jane, what are the opportunities for doing business in Saigon? Saigon is known as the world's best startup hub. People from all around the world gather here to get their business up and running comes with limited overhead. There is a significant plume in the investment for startup accounted for 1 billion USD in 2018, tripled the value compared to 300 million USD in 2017. There are more than 40 investment firms from all around the world supporting various industries focusing on travel tech, food tech, and fintech. Oh look, that's Nguyen Huệ Walking Street where REI Festival takes place every year, a mercy event where local designers combine a modern perspective onto a traditional dress of Vietnam in combination with the cultural activities. Oh, and don't miss out Le Mai Herbal Artisanal Workshop, just 15 minutes away from the city center, where you can take home everything that you make from the workshop using local <coughs> herbal source, which can help you to relax, rejuvenate, and neutral your mind, body, and soul. Hey, Ting, we should not miss out the nightlife in Saigon, huh? Of course, Bubi Walking Street is now at Never Sleep Road, a popular entertainment destination for foreigners and young people, especially the millennial generation, accumulated for more than 50% of the population of Saigon. They are young, fast, fun, and has fair work ethic. 
Saigon is forecast to become Asia's second fastest growing economy in the next five years, and this growth is already well underway. It is an open, inclusive city, rapidly becoming in globally integrated place to do business. Welcome, Welcome to Saigon Next Bloom. On behalf of Hasei University, thank you so much for your listening. Thank you so much. Now it's curious session. Xin chào and cảm ơn. Thank you. I am very, very impressed that you pull out a lot of uh, key reasons. Um, even though I've been to Saigon quite a few times, like Kiri and I just mentioned about the new venue, we didn't know, so congratulations on mentioning that. Uh, the heritage, architectural, traditional medicine that is very in trend at, on trend at the moment. So thank you for mentioning that. Uh, we also particularly quite uh, um, impressed with how well you know about the millennial lifestyle. And we will have two airport. One is Tung Sen Yuk Airport for domestic and some international route, and the second one is Long Tan International Airport, which will uh, help us to widen the route and uh, have more route for coming from other country to our cities. In addition, sorry. In addition, we all mentioned about the sharing economies, which is just mentioned about Grab and another taxis apps, which is just help us to enhance the. Uh, transportation and then we can cooperate with other like driver so we can have the less transport so we have the more change and we can it's the potential resource for us to do a business with that one thank you thank you yeah, thank you so having done events in Ultimate City the one way to overcome the traffic challenge would be to plan your itinerary around your key venue. Um, so my question is about uh, specifics that fall. So you mentioned things like the Aoyai uh, festival, um, but you know, is it during the event dates of, uh, you know, I believe we are still confirming dates sometime in November, you know, so it's good to have a lot of variety, but we need to still root it within, uh, you know, a framework of the specific dates. Yes, thank you for your questions. We would like to answer regarding to your questions that the Aoyai Festival is takes place every year. However, it's not always like quickly. However, there is a Aoyai exhibition right at Nguyen Huan Walking Street, which is the very a small size of the Aoyai Festival, where you can experience, where you can like take a look at the Aoyai, the history of Aoyai, and even the, the cultural activities over there. The LEI festival will take place in November. That's why we chose it to put in our uh, proposal for the site conference. Thank you for your listening and thank you for thank your you questions. So much. Thank you.